Welcome to 24 Murphy Road in the seaside village of Hyannis. This is situated in the heart of the village, which means you're just steps away from downtown, a bike away from the beaches, and just a few doors away from the Hyannis Youth and Community Center where there's year-round activities and events uh, for all ages and interests. This uh, home is uh, from the early mid-century and so has all the charm and character of the 1920s, 40s kind of vintage with the Dutch colonial style. Lots of windows and even a third floor walk-up attic that could be finished for additional space. Wonderful mature trees providing shade in the late afternoon and a lovely level yard. This lot is twice as large as most lots for homes in this area. There would be room to add a garage. There is not one now, but we'll take a quick walk around so that you can see the driveway area and back how much of a side yard there is that would allow to add on off this side, which is living room and dining room on this end of the house. So we'll take a step inside so that you can get an idea of the charm and character of this lovely village home. As we step in the front door to this first floor with all hardwood in the living areas, you will appreciate the character and expansive detail of a house from this vintage. We're in a gracious foyer, lovely stairs going up to the second level, kitchen right behind the uh, living room here. These floors have all been just redone in their beautiful honey-colored pale oak. Lots of windows. These are replacement windows, so a lot of those kinds of major work issues have been taken care of. Fireplace wall through to the dining room. Generous size room, as is this formal dining room. Side door entry, looking out to the backyard. And back through to the kitchen from here. As we step in, really nice size, generous kitchen with lovely cabinetry, ample counter space, room for a small table here in the Eden kitchen, and the laundry is over here, also incorporated into this multi purpose room. And through here, we're going to take a look out to the backyard, mud room with a half bath on the left. Okay, and a very large closet on the right as you um, as we take a step back into the kitchen. So we'll swing around, and this will give us another look back at the kitchen, so that you can again just get another perspective on that through to the dining room and living room beyond, and then this is back to the front foyer. So we also have another room which is currently used as a bedroom on this floor. This is your foyer closet, again with the beautiful refinished oak floors. Front to back room, again used as a bedroom now, but certainly could be a family room, library, depending on how you figure, feel, feel you would best use the space. And then we'll take a quick trip upstairs and we'll look at the second floor. Here we are at the second floor landing. Just take a quick look back down the stairs to the foyer on the first floor. We have a nice large closet on our left here. A generous sized bath, full bath, on this level. Tile floor. Large vanity built in cabinet there. Swing around so you can see the tub shower at the back. Back to the landing and we'll go into this bedroom which is special. Again the oak hardwood floors, oil, hot water, heat, nice closet here and through this door up to an expansive third floor attic that could be finished for additional space. We'll just take a quick look up so you can get an idea 
of it, the real board floors, all the construction detail from this era that just doesn't get built this way anymore. And as we go back down the stairs to that bedroom, we will go to another bedroom on this level that uh, we have the door closed because there's a kitty in here. Again, the hardwood floors, generous size rooms. So there's three bedrooms on this floor, all three with hardwood, good size rooms, closet over here. Quite two large closets on this, in this bedroom. The third bedroom on this floor is in the process of being cleaned out. Um, there's still some things in there, so we aren't going to film that. But it's very similar to these two rooms. In other words, it's a good sized bedroom with a closet and it has the hardwood floors. So that completes our tour of the upper stories of this charming home that's ready to maybe update a little bit, but keep its charms and make it your own. As we wrap up our tour, we're in the backyard of this wonderful home in the heart of Hyannis. And we're looking at the back of the home. As you can see with the Dutch colonial gambrel style, you have dormers both on the front and the back. So expansive room upstairs, which we saw when we looked inside. Nice side yard looking over to the, again, the driveway area beyond to what becomes a very spacious backyard. You're on town sewer, so you don't have the concerns of a septic in the front or the backyard. So we're going to pan around here just so you can get an idea of how private it really is and how screened it is from the neighbors. So you really have wonderful privacy amidst the lovely trees on a day like this with a beautiful breeze coming from just off the ocean, which is why we live here on Cape Cod beautiful cool breeze and we welcome you to come and take a look at this home and see if it might suit your needs make it your home on Cape Cod